In the beginning, there was chaos, a void, an emptiness that held within it the seeds of the universe. From this primordial abyss, emerged the first of the deities, a being so vast, so essential, that her name has echoed through millennia. Gaia, the personification of Earth, the mother of all life. Today, we journey through time, myth, and the wonders of our planet to uncover the story of Gaia, the ancestral heartbeat of our world. Join us as we peel back the layers of legend and Earth's crust to reveal the enduring legacy of Gaia, whose spirit animates the very ground beneath our feet. Imagine, if you will, a universe where nothing exists. No light, no dark, just an endless expanse of nothingness. And then, from this nothing, something extraordinary happens. Gaia emerges. Unlike anything before her, Gaia is the earth, the ground, the very foundation of all life. According to the ancient Greeks, she was one of the first beings to appear at the dawn of existence, born from chaos itself. But Gaia was not just a passive piece of rock floating in space, she was alive, vibrant, and creative. Gaia's loneliness in the vastness of the universe led to the creation of her first children. She gave birth to the sky, Uranus, to cover her, the mountains, and the sea, Pontus. But it was with Uranus that Gaia's legacy would truly begin to unfold. Together, they became the parents of the Titans, the Cyclopes, and the Hecaton Kyrs, or Hundred-Handed Giants. These children were powerful, each embodying different aspects of the world Gaia held dominion over. Yet, it was not a harmonious family. Uranus, fearing the power of his children, imprisoned them within the earth, causing Gaia great pain. In her anguish, Gaia crafted a plan to free her children, creating a giant sickle from her own elements. She enlisted her youngest titan son, Cronus, to wield it. In a defining moment of courage and betrayal, Cronus overthrew Uranus, setting free his siblings. This act marked the beginning of a new era, but also a cycle of betrayal within Gaia's lineage that would echo through generations. The Titanomachy, a war between the Titans led by Cronus and the Olympians, who were the offspring of Cronus, eventually led to the defeat of the Titans. The victorious Olympians, led by Zeus, established a new order, with Gaia's grandsons and granddaughters, including Zeus himself, reigning supreme. Yet, Gaia's story and her influence were far from over. Despite the rise of the Olympian gods, Gaia's presence remained integral to the ancient world. She was revered as the ultimate mother, a nurturer, and a provider. Her domains extended beyond the fertile earth to include the sanctity of oaths and the mysteries of prophecy. Temples and oracles dedicated to Gaia were places of immense spiritual significance, where ancient Greeks would seek guidance and wisdom. Fast forward to the modern era, and Gaia's influence persists, transcending myth to inspire a contemporary understanding of our planet. The Gaia hypothesis, proposed by scientist James Lovelock and microbiologist Lynn Margulis in the 1970s, presents Earth as a self-regulating, complex system, much like a living organism. This revolutionary idea has reshaped our approach to environmental science, emphasizing the interconnectedness of life and the Earth's systems. Today, Gaia serves as a symbol of environmental awareness and conservation, urging us to remember our roots and our responsibility to the planet that sustains us. She embodies the idea that Earth is not just a resource to be exploited, but a living, breathing entity that nurtures and supports all forms of life. As children of Gaia, 
We hold a unique position within the tapestry of life. We have the power to protect or harm, to nurture or neglect our planetary home. The myths of Gaia remind us of our origins, our connection to the Earth, and the cycles of nature that govern existence. They call on us to honor our relationship with the Earth, to remember that we are but one thread in the vast web of life that Gaia weaves. In an age where the balance of nature is increasingly threatened, the story of Gaia challenges us to rethink our relationship with the Earth. It invites us to embrace a future where humanity and nature coexist in harmony, where the lessons of the past inform the decisions of the future. It is a call to action, urging us to become stewards of the Earth, to protect and cherish this incredible planet that Gaia has entrusted to us. From the void of chaos to the lush, vibrant Earth that cradles life today, Gaia's journey is a testament to the power of creation, resilience, and the enduring spirit of nature. As we stand on the brink of a new dawn, let us carry forward the legacy of Gaia. Let us weave a future where the Earth thrives, a testament to our respect, our love, and our unbreakable bond with the mother of all life. And so, as the sun sets on our tail, we're reminded of the cycles that govern the cosmos, of endings that herald beginnings, and of the eternal dance between creation and destruction. Gaia, the Earth Mother, stands as a beacon of hope and a reminder of the infinite possibilities that unfold when we honor our world. In the heartbeats of this ancient deity, we find the rhythms of our own existence, a melody that binds us to the Earth, urging us to protect its majesty for generations to come. Thank you for joining us on this epic journey through the heart of our planet's story. As we close this chapter, remember that the story of Gaia is not just a myth from the past, it's a living, breathing call to action. It's a reminder that we, too, can shape the future of our world, for we are all children of Gaia, custodians of the Earth. Until next time, keep wondering, keep exploring, and remember to tread gently on this beautiful planet that is our home. Did you know? The subscribe button is like the library's version of a chocolate chip cookie. Every time you hit it, a book on a library shelf gets an extra sprinkle of fairy dust. So, if you enjoyed this video and want to sprinkle some magic, don't forget to like and subscribe to our library channel.